Razabani for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. I'm delighted to have with me a victorious Junior Thompson. Junior, firstly, how are we doing? Um, very good now after that. Um, as you know, I've been out the ring for probably 20 months, so just to get back in and get the cobwebs off and um, be back amongst the atmosphere was, was uh, you know, I, I can't put it into words. Boss, be back. Seems like it's my first question to everybody. The last 18 months have been difficult for it for everyone, especially kind of the small hall shows. Has it been tough to keep yourself kind of mentally, mindset, motivated? Yeah, to be honest, I'll be honest with you mate, um, in the middle of last year, 2020, I was looking at just knocking on the head. Just because obviously everything was so uncertain and you know, without the small hall shows, it's hard for, for lads like us to get on shows. So at that time, it, it gets to the point where it's, you know, you've got to pay rent. So I was thinking about just going back to work and knocking it on the head. Or, but you know, I stuck to it and persevered and Thankfully, we're back. I know you, over the course of the last 18 months, you probably got told you're going to be out next month and you're waiting in the next month. But obviously, you've probably been watching the news. The restrictions started to ease. When you got the phone call to say, this is the date in Manchester, what was the reaction? It was, it was a no-brainer. I got asked, uh, it was, I think, about seven weeks ago. Um, I said, do you want to fight in, in um, July 24th? I said, it's a no-brainer. I'll be ready. I'd have been ready in four weeks to be honest with you, I was, I was that, that keen to get back out. It was just a no-brainer. What was the feeling like walking into the ring? <laughs> Do you know what? It was, I was nervous, I'm not going to lie. You know, when, you, it, it was, it, um, when you've been out of the ring so long, it's all new again. I was walking and we, I don't know if you see me, me, me uh, cuff got caught on the side of the ring and stuff. I was just trying to get yourself into the ring as fast as possible, but again, it's all part and parcel of getting back on on the scene really. How do you assess your performance? Obviously you got the rounds in which is yeah. the most important thing and they'll probably benefit you in the long run. Definitely, well as you know that's only my third fight um, that's my first six rounder so doing six rounds after being out for 20 months was difficult um, again it was just all learning and, and being back under the lights again it was just you know it's priceless it's pri priceless um, educational rounds for me getting out there especially against a game kid as you saw he didn't take one backward step didn't stop punching he made me work for six rounds which I needed what's the plans next now you want to I'm guessing want to stay as active as possible now you know I'll, I'll, the next possible date I'll be out um, again it's out of my control you know I'll, ask, I'll go back to D and we'll start again but whenever Pat's got a show or anyone you know has got a show and invite us on I'll be there it's a juicy division that middleweight division not just from a British scene, but generally overall as a world scene, it's a, it's a juicy, juicy division. You want to get yourself in that top 15 mix quite quickly. A hundred percent. That's why, you know, it's, I mean, it's only my third fight. Um, I've gone straight into a six rounder after, after a big layoff. Um, I don't really want to waste time. You know, I want to see how far I can get fast. I don't, I'm not one for, you know, taking it easy route. I never have been my whole life. Um, so yeah, it's, it's just one of them things, as, as fast as I can get up there, I know it's a, it's a tough division, um, but I'm willing to work hard and, and you know, make things happen if I can. Any celebration tonight? <sighs> just going to have a quiet one and go on. <laughs> they, they've all been saying the same thing to me today. Yeah, do you know what it is? I, I was saying to my friends, I'm, I'm going to go out and celebrate, but I reckon the coach home, I'll be snoring all the way home now. <laughs> well, congratulations again, Junior, and hopefully we'll catch up with you very soon. Junior Thompson, IFL TV, thank you very much.